Okay, we are going to speak about a Docker file. Docker file is a file which help us to make our own, to create our own image by or modified from some exist image. Let's start. For first, we are we make a Docker. Uh, touch a docker file the docker file name should be exactly like this docker file is starting by uppercase D and then continue So Let me open the sublime here and in the docker file we are writing from let me change something here from engine X we are using some the image that we have. I have an Nginx, the latest, uh, latest one. I have an Nginx Alpine here. I could use a Python if I know, uh, if needed, Ubuntu, or some my own image that I already made it like a uh, three weeks ago. But anyway, if we are not give a tag here. It will be automatically use the latest one so I will use the latest one I just want to make a image at the moment uh, to run some comment we are writing the run and like a M Kadir make some folder call a folder hello hello Let's save it and let's run to see what will what will happen. To create an image by Docker file, we are writing Docker build dash t dash t and give a name to this, like a like a my nginx, and we will write. I push a dot, a dot here. It's the pass. The pass is here, and because I'm inside uh, this UTB, UTBB folders, and the Docker file also is here, so the pass will be dot. Let's do it. Okay. Docker image. As you see, I have my Nginx, and it's made like a five second ago. Let's run it. Docker run. Let's run it the background. Give a name. Give a name to. It'll be engine X and and use my engine X. So run an image on the background. Give it uh, give a container name, engine X, and use my engine X image that is here. Enter Docker execute. Uh, engine X Docker execute. Docker execute dash uh, it the container name and sh as a shell. So ls and here we have this hello file. As you see, let's exit and do something else. Exit Docker stop all of the container. Docker remove all of the container even okay let's a uh, little bit change mm, or docker file it will be like a copy on a copy some file from my computer to the container from the host to the container this will be the haha txt file and I will copy it to the hello folder. So 
hello folder okay just let me create this haha txt so we have it here it's here and docker build okay docker image okay it's made a new one here and uh, docker clear docker run let's everything will be same docker run background name nginx my nginx from nginx okay docker execute it 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 engine x yes okay and ls we have a hello folder here cd hello ls and we have haha dot txt i guess was here so what we can do else we can change or let me exit from here uh, docker stop docker remove clear okay i want uh, to uh, to do what, what i want to do when i'm going to the container i want to be the default folder should be hello so the work work directory will be or hello work dear hello okay save docker build same docker run same and docker exec execute also the same where we are here we are in the hello folder it's this folder is still like our default start work directory so what we have here we have haha txt let's exit and do something else exit clear docker stop every container docker remove also and every any covering container so what we have to do next okay now what i want to do i want to run the image once again make a container i run it on the port 8000 docker run uh, background name port 8000 nginx run it let's check a browser okay it's working no docker execute okay ls cd back but and cd and cd Uh, user oh, let me explain first uh, this page that you see it's on this uh, on this pass on, on a container is nginx HTML so we are going to do let me do it like this user thank you CDV okay pwd ls here we have an index html that's this one uh, let's check if i have a vim which vim i don't have a vim let's me install it and we'll come back or actually let's install it together mm. APT if I would not get update first 
Yes. Control C. That's what it puts first. And the next one will be APT. Get um, install install Vim. How to copy? You know, uh, you choose what you want on a terminal. If it's right click, it's not forking as mine is not forking. Choose what you want. Uh, Control Shift C will be copy from terminal. Control Shift V will be paste inside the terminal. So install yes. Then we're going to be Vim. Let me clear first. LS Vim index html the title this one is a title um, to start writing uh, inside the vim you need to push i and here you see the insert now you can change everything that you want it will be my nginx and welcome to my nginx okay and then escape i put the x like this and it's safe now refresh and we see the title changed and the body also changed too so what if we want to make a, some index file here uh, on the host and put it inside the container directly let's exit from here docker stop docker remove okay I will remove this one. I we I want to supply some index HTML here. Why HTML? Oh, let's don't do it. Let's just the H1 close it. Hello, my engine X. Why you write this one, do? Okay, let's be like this. Save. We have it here. Let's go back to our Docker file. Let it be here, but we will change our work directory to this one. We will copy here. What we want to copy here, we want to copy our index HTML to here. But before we have to run, remove what we want to remove from here, we want to remove the HTM, uh, index HTML that is exist inside the container already by default so uh, we make some 
container anyway some uh, folder anyway we change our directory to the default uh, work directory and we remove the index HTML this one that's by default and we copy or index HTML this one inside this directory save it docker uh, build same name it's okay clear uh, docker run everything is clear here yes res see what we have here we have hello my nginx what if i change something here mm. it will be on the compose the compose will be okay we need the volume to change and get the change uh, on a real time so what we have here more let's me think and come back okay let's add uh, let's install let's update our container and install a vim inside text editor vim text editor inside the container using docker file here i think that we don't need to, this one work directory is okay run apt get update okay the next one will be run apt get install dash v and vim this one it means that do you remember when we installed the uh, vim inside the container it was some uh, asking some question is a yes or no by dash uh, why we are saying that the yes the answer will be yes automatically and it will be installed successfully docker build my nginx okay Okay, Docker run. Docker execute. LS is still working here. Yes. Then Vim index HTML. We should have a Vim at the moment. Yes, we have. Push I. Third. H3 Vim is here close it escape X and reload it yes we have it exit docker stop everything docker remove Everything is clear. Docker image. So, as you see, we made uh, a container. Inside the container, it's already will be install the the update and install the Vim. The pass the default pass will be changed to the HTML and it will be copy this index HTML there. So that's all. Thank you for watching, waiting for your like and comments. Have a good day.